It's so good to see you here. We're so excited you're, you're starting at Neomed. I haven't seen you since the interview day. Um, it's awesome to have you here. Welcome and good luck. Jubilee, I just talked to your mom. So glad to finally have you on campus. Hey, Aubrey. Congratulations. Go Raiders. <laughs> Hey, is that Taylor over there? I think it is. Yeah. Hey, Ashley uh -huh. Claire, good to see you. And then that's Monica too. Everybody, all you P1s, all you M1s, from the Office of Admission, it was so fun interviewing you all. We're so happy to have you on campus starting. Um, good luck, we're gonna need plenty of tour guides, ambassadors. Don't forget about us little people now that you're in. <laughs> and we have just one really important thing for you to remember as you get started. Don't, Don't forget, forget to send your official trial transcripts. W, welcome to Wasson. A, always a pleasure to see you. S, you'll see our standardized patients in simulation. S, so excited to see you. O, you'll have so much fun. N, you'll never forget your experiences at Neomed. Welcome. Hello, new first year medical students. Welcome to Neomed. I'm Dr. John Boultry, Chairman of the Department of Family and Community Medicine. Our faculty serve as course directors for more than 10 courses and as advisors for many student interest groups, such as Family Medicine Interest Group and the Rural Medicine Interest Group, the Outreach Group, Scientista, Physicians for Human Rights, the Q Club, the Palliative Interest Group, and the Geriatrics in Interest Group. We are here to support you in many ways such as opportunities in family medicine, public health, geriatrics, palliative care, bioethics and humanities. Also, we are home to the urban and rural pathways and the student run free clinic. We also have a number of summer programs such as research fellowships on topics like public health, underserved care and health disparities, medical ethics. Another summer activity we have is a paid summer preceptorship where you get paid to work with a physician for four weeks between your first and second year. With that, you complete a quality improvement project and you prepare a poster presentation, which we also help you with. Stop by and see us anytime. We're in G115. You'll find comfortable study spaces both in and outside of our department. Also, you can learn more about us on our touch screen, which is right outside our office. We look forward to seeing you. Thank you. Welcome to Neomed. I'm Dale Haluk. Director of Campus Operations, and I want to sincerely welcome you to a great facility, proudly cared for by great people. It's always our goal in Campus Ops to provide the highest quality environmental conditions, both in our buildings and in our beautiful grounds. We take our jobs very seriously, and we care deeply about your education and experience here at Neomed. Now watch closely as you'll see the people in this video all around campus. I'd like for them to tell you what they do. Hi, I'm Jerry Berkshire. Supervisor of Physical Plant Services. We are Neomed's Diversified Services Grill. We plant it, move it, mulch it, mow it, plow it. We, we keep, keep Neomed, Neomed beautiful. beautiful. Hello, I'm Skip Barnes, Lead Maintenance Repair Worker Campus Operation. We can build it, tear it down, fix it, and maintain it. Our team provides highly skilled maintenance services. I mean really high. And we're here for your safety too. And, and we, we keep, keep it all running. running. We are the fast movers of Neomed's Pony Express. We sort it. We ship it. We receive it and deliver it. And we recycle. <laughs> we are Campus Operations. What can we do for you today? Welcome to Neomed from the staff of Student Affairs. Hi, my name is Ken. Welcome to Neomed. You won't be disappointed if you come here. This is a beautiful school and wonderful people around this school. Have a nice day. Hi, welcome to Neomed. I'm Kathy, the morning receptionist. I tell people where to go. If you need anything, I have a drawer with all kinds of stuff. Mints, band-aids, I don't know what you might need. But just stop and see me. I give good directions 
then welcome. Three. Welcome to Neomed. Hi, I'm Jess at Erie Island Coffee. Welcome to Neomed. Hi, I'm Dr. Cross. This is Brisbane's Pharmacy at Neomed. Welcome, welcome to Neomed. Welcome to Neomed. I am Amy and Hesha. Welcome to Neomed. Hello, new students. My name is Monica and I'm trying to keep this place clean. Welcome to Neomed. Welcome students. My name is Dr. Angela Dash. I'm the Ombuds. Neomed Ombuds. That means I am a confidential resource. Any student and any employee can come to me confidentially and off the record if you have any issues, concerns, or disputes. Anything that you can think of related to your enrollment here at Neomed. I'm in the library room 209. Call me, walk in, schedule an appointment. I can even meet you through Skype or off campus. Again, welcome. This is Jane at the IT Help Desk. Come and see her if you have any computer questions. Hi, Hi Welcome, welcome to Neomed. Hi, welcome to Neomed. Welcome, welcome to Neomed. in the print shop. He's too shy to be on camera, but come visit him. Hi, welcome to Neil. Hi, enjoy your time here. Class of 2021. Welcome to Neil. Welcome, come on in. This is the College of Medicine. I'm Elizabeth Young, the Interim Dean of the College of Medicine. Come on in, get to know us a little bit. This is Lori Ramsey. Lori, welcome. Lori's been with us for a long time and she's the first person you'll meet when you walk in the door and she can help you get where you need to be. Let's, let's come on back and meet some of the faculty. Our first stop is going to be with Dr. Joe Zarconi. He was a member of the first class, College of Medicine class, class of 1981, the charter class. Dr. Zarconi. Good morning. Welcome. How are you? So I'm Joe Zarconi. I have a number of hats that I wear. So one is involved in humanities education. So you may see me in some of the human values of medicine teaching. Uh, I'm chairman of medicine. So if you decide that you're interested in internal medicine, you may encounter me. And I'm also now interim associate dean for health affairs, helping Dr. Young leave the dean's office. Good to have you with us. Have a great day. Thank you. Now we're going to go meet Dr. Weiss. She's the associate dean of the overall curriculum. And she does a lot of teaching in the curriculum as well. She interacts with both the College of Medicine students and the College of Pharmacy students. Come on in. Dr. Weiss. Hello. How are you? Oh, I am uh, Lisa Weiss. Sorry, I'm the Associate Dean of Curriculum. I also am a course director, so I oversee with a very large team um, all the College of Medicine curriculum from M1 all the way through M4. So welcome. Thanks, Dr. Weiss. Have a good day. Now we're going to go meet Dr. Eugene Moad. Dr. Moad is our Vice Dean of the College of Medicine. He's also a pediatrician, but I'll let him tell you about himself. Dr. Moad. Hello. Welcome to Neomed. I'm Eugene Moad. I'm the Interim Vice Dean for the College of Medicine and the Associate Dean for Clinical Affairs. My job as Vice Dean is not to know everything, but to know everyone. So we will never let you be lost within the College of Medicine and get you to where you need to go. And my job as the Associate Dean of Clinical Affairs is to connect you with over two dozen hospital partners and over 2,000 clinical faculty that will make your clinical education one of the best that we have to offer. Take care. Thanks, Dr. Moed. Have a great day. And last but certainly not least, we're going to go see Dr. Paul Lacaw, who's a beloved faculty member, but also our Assistant Dean of Students. We're coming to see you. This is Dr. Laka. Congratulations, welcome to Neomed. I hope you'll take a moment to come visit me when you get a chance. Outstanding, have a great day. You too, thanks you guys. Okay, this is the really important part of the College of Medicine that you need to know about. Right here by the front door is this little kitchen area. Come on. There are always snacks. So, good morning and welcome. My name is Richard Kasmer, and I am the Dean of the College of Pharmacy. Welcome, why don't you come on into the college? During your time here at the college, we have 
and experience, which is a cutting edge curriculum, which will help you at the end of the experience be prepared to be practice ready, team ready, and career ready. Within the college, we have two departments. We have pharmacy practice, which is our practicing pharmacists. And we have pharmaceutical science, which is our basic scientists who do research in the RGE building. Um, and we have full faculty and staff that will support you in your effort while you're here. Here in the Dean's office, we have a variety of additional staff. I'll let them introduce themselves. I'm Maria Pizer, Executive Administrative Assistant. I'm Kim Kennedy, Assistant Director of Operations. Jackie Hart, Executive Director of Operations. Consider us as your hub for while you're here in the College of Pharmacy. And by all means, as a student, be sure to have fun. some fun while you're here as a pharmacy student. Welcome! We're the College of Graduate Studies! I'm Steve Schmidt. I'm the Dean of the College of Graduate Studies, and this is our College of Graduate Studies team. My name is Amy Lee, and I'm Program Director for the Consortium of Eastern Ohio Master Public Health. And my name is Scott Wisniewski, and I am the Program Director for the Master's Degree in Health System Pharmacy Administration. I'm Julie Altman. I am the Program Director for the MA Program in Medical Ethics and Humanities, the Bioethics Certificate, and the Global Health Certificate. Denise Inman, I am the Program Director for Innovative Pharmaceutical Medicine. I'm Philip Jenkinson, I'm your Program Coordinator. I'm Kelly Schrock, Program Coordinator. Hi, my name is Amy Lee. I'm Program Director for the Consortium of Eastern Ohio Master Public Health Program. Are you interested in learning more about population health, or maybe health promotion, or health services administration, or what about epidemiology? Talk to me and we'll try to figure something out for you. The Master of Public Health degree is 42 semester credits, and we can try to fit it in with your coursework. And some of the other fun things that we do, we take students to conferences, state and national, we do food drives, and when we have celebrations to celebrate students who have been with the program for one or two years, we take them for celebrations. For example, we've been to the Nautica Queen, and last year we went to the zoo. We'll see you. This is the Neomed Police Department, and we would like to welcome you to Neomed. Our department's dedication to this campus is based on our core values of integrity, safety, professionalism, service, and teamwork. We are dedicated to addressing your needs here at Neomed. Through foot and vehicle patrols, response to calls for service such as medical emergencies, vehicle lockouts, and jump starts, ID cards, and safety presentations, we are here to serve you. Welcome, welcome to, to Neomed! Med. Welcome new students to Neomed and welcome to the Nook Bookstore. My name is Chris and I'm the bookstore supervisor. Please stop in for all your Neomed apparel needs, books, gift ideas, anything you may need, we may have it. If we don't have it, ask for it and maybe I can get that for you. But one of our best things is our frequent buyer club and be sure to join it. And what, what it does is every time you purchase something from the bookstore, it goes in under your name and you earn 5% back in rebates. Another great new item we have here are the custom apparel. You can pick any of these blank items and have any of the graphics put on it. The price on the apparel does include the graphic. So be unique, be, be different, and make your own shirt. But please stop in and see me someday. Hi, welcome to Neomed. My name is Jackie Olick and I work in information technology. We can be a great resource for students. Our help desk is available five days a week. Student Wi-Fi is available throughout the campus, including the courtyard, which is a great place to eat lunch when the weather's nice, and the village. I wish you well at Neomed, and have a great time while you're here. Hello, new students. I'm Tom Klingler, the Chief Medical Librarian, also known as the Library Director. They call me TK. Come see us here in our little library. You'll see very little physical content. 90% of our content's online, but you need to come in soon and meet Stephanie our reference librarian and learn how to access all the digital materials. Stephanie? Thanks TK. I'm going to take the students now on a tour of the library. It's a group study room over here which is um, useful for your studying, your groups, 
We have copy machines, um, printers. You can pair your ID badge to them for printing. There's a few computers here for anyone to use. You can just walk up, do a little bit of research or do some printing. Here's my office and I can assist you with any type of reference question. So if you need help accessing an article or accessing a database or using your eBooks for your textbooks, I can help you with any of those kind of questions that you might have. Anything your lab related, I can help you. We have our coffee machine. And then we have our combined IT help library help desk. So you can go here to answer, to ask any of your at library related questions if you need to check out a book if you need to um, pick up a book or if you have a reference question and you need you don't know who to ask you can come to um, this desk and they will get you to the right person if you have IT related questions password resets things like that you can always come here to this one single stop desk to get the help that you need this is a 24 7 quiet study area and that concludes our tour. So please come see us and welcome to Neomed. Welcome students. If you're experiencing any of the signs of distress, please be aware of them. Personality change, agitation, withdrawal, poor self-care, hopelessness. If you or your colleagues are experiencing any of these symptoms, please seek help. We want you to be happy and healthy. Hi, I'm Ray Notoreski of Academic Technology Services. I'd like to welcome you all to the university and hope you have a successful first year. So what I'd like to do now is give you a little overview of what the Academic Technology team does on a daily basis. Cilantro and Akron. My favorite restaurant is 157 Sushi Restaurant in Kent. My favorite restaurant, oh, I like Paladar Kitchen. Mexican, Cuban, uh, fusion, awesome, especially in the summertime when you sit outdoors. Oh, it's um, in Eaton, which is off of Chagrin Boulevard in the Beachwood area. Best gyro. Where's it at? It's on Route 8 in Northfield. <laughs> um, how about, I'll just say Brito's and Cape. Um, Blue Canyon. I think Mustard Seed Cafe in Highland Square. The Wine Mill in Stowe, Ohio. I don't, I don't go out. <laughs> Wendy's. Wendy's. <laughs> Chipotle. <laughs> I like going to Ray's and Kent. <laughs> Twisted Olive. Where's that? It's in uh, North Camp. Diamond Grill in Akron. The Wolf Tavern. My favorite restaurant in Northeast Ohio is Primanti Brothers. Um, Bombay Grill. It's an Indian restaurant. It's, it used to be in Cuyahoga Falls and now it's in Fairline. That's my favorite. I go there at least twice a month. My favorite restaurant in Northeast Ohio is Vaccaro's in, in um, Akron, Bath. Right on 77 and Gent Road. That's my favorite restaurant. Great martini. El Mexicano in Talmadge. Olive Garden. Favorite restaurant in uh -huh. Northeast Ohio? Yeah. It's The Merchant. Where's that? Down in the valley by Cuyahoga National Park. I like Rockney's in Kent. Taco Where'd Tantos. You go? Taco Tantos? Uh, the Blue Door. In Cuyahoga Falls. Panini's in Kent. Oh, that's a good one. There Cello's in Ravenna. Nice. Luigi's in Akron. So often I find myself at Lee Asian Cuisine because they have hot pots in North Kent and it's one of the best Asian cuisines you can find in the area. The Rail in Canton, Ohio. Zeppi's up in Hudson. Pad Thai in Hudson. Lowe's in Cuyahoga Falls. <laughs> we go to Bellachino's in Stowe.
I like Jalisco's. We were just talking about it. It's an alliance. <laughs> I like hibachi over in Cuck Falls. I like the bistro in green. Blue Canyon. <laughs> Pizza is my favorite place to go. Jalisco's. Okay. Arnie's. Right by West Branch Steakhouse. Fine. Twinsburg, Ohio. Blue Canyon. One of my favorite restaurants is Ni Rancho in Rootstown, Ohio. <laughs> yeah! Very close, quite convenient, quite fast. I really like Swenson's and Akron and North Canton. It's really good food. So. And I really like Ni Rancho. It's like down the street from Neomed and they have um, $2 Taco Tuesdays. BJ's Brew House is a really, I like it. I like it because I'm vegetarian and they have a larger selection. Rockney's and Kent. In Youngstown, go to Imbibe Martini Bar. Nate, what's your favorite restaurant in Northeast Ohio? I love Red Lobster. My favorite place to eat out is a place called Michael Alberini's in Youngstown, Ohio. Three. My favorite restaurant is a Brazilian restaurant called Bomba in Fairlawn, Ohio. My favorite restaurant is in Belden Village and it's called Wasabi. Subway's the only restaurant I know. Taco Bell, maybe? <laughs> uh, I like to go to Sarah's Vineyard at Cuyahoga Falls, Ohio. My favorite restaurant is Gervasi in North Canton. My favorite restaurant is First Watch in Cuyahoga Falls. I recommend the Hartville Kitchen. Awesome, 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 uh, lead maintenance repair worker campus operations. We can build it, tear it Wait, down. What are you doing? As soon as they start a restaurant in Northeast Ohio. I don't. I don't go out. <laughs> Wendy's. Wendy's. Chipotle. <laughs> I'm too old to remember names. Sorry. <laughs> Hi, I'm Kathy, the front desk receptionist. In the morning. <laughs> there you go. We are the fast movers of Neomed's Pony God, Express. Right? People with cheesecake, they overlook your shortcomings, so it's gotten me really far, yeah. uh, actually. With the Akron General people, but <laughs> we like cheesecake, too. <laughs> oh, you'll have so much fun. <laughs> don't, don't, don't video yet. Um, we're going to edit. Oh, no, but I'm getting filmed on Hermity's phone, so take your time. Okay. Bye. <laughs> I don't know what that is now. Oh, Where did you say it? <laughs> Back to Travis. Oh, I have to think. What's new? Oh. I really have to think about that. Are we live? Oh. Or are we recording? No, we're not recording right now. I have these Ohio is. Oh, my favorite restaurant. Oh, my goodness. Um, Hi, welcome to Maniel. <laughs> <laughs> Where did I get that? Cut. Before you telling us what your favorite restaurant is in Northeast Ohio. Today, like this? Yeah. Like right now, you're on. <laughs> you look so are you yeah. singing? Yeah. Yeah. No. Did you would you, did we, would no. you like to record your <laughs> Wait, you're like putting it on? Here, let me help that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah. Does it right now? What's yeah. your favorite restaurant? Real quick. <laughs> Super quick. What your favorite restaurant is in the area? <laughs> Panera. <laughs> what Panera? are you guys doing? Ruthie. Ruthie. <laughs> Ruthie. Ruthie. I will not be on Ruthie. 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 What is your favorite restaurant? Come on, let the incoming students know. Where's a good place to eat? Um, the Mexican place. I forget the name. Mi Rancho down the street? Yeah, let's go there. Okay, Mi Rancho. Okay. All right. Uh, hi, I'm Katie. I was supposed to say our names. Keep going. Keep going. <laughs> <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs>